Hello, good, good evening, everybody. I'm your host, Club, Club by the host of the Club of Sports, we're coming to you live right here in Freeport, New York, by the way. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I'll get you guys into the um, what went down to night one of the 2021 WWE draft. Who was in, who stays, who goes. I'll get, get you guys to that. I'll take us about the fact that the King of the Ring tournament is coming back by next week, starting next week. And also, a Queen's Crown tournament is also coming as well. And the competitors have not been announced yet. I'll tell you guys about the fact that. Um, also here that um, Lisa Baird has resigned despite misconduct allegations by uh, Paul Riley and also the general counsel of the NWSL, Lisa Levine. She has also stepped away as well. The Great Freak went undercover at a CVS. Gives you guys the fact that, uh, Bian- that uh, Becky Lynch is going to defend her SmackDown Women's title against Bianca Belair and Sasha Banks at Crown Jewel. Talking about the fact that, uh, let's see here, Gronk and Ed will not be at the re- uh, reun- reunion tomorrow, by the way, because of a rib injury. He's got uh, a fractured ribs that he has. Lamb Bell's debit, debut at the, um, against the Broncos. Clay Kirsch has a four- forearm injury, placing him on the, show- on the 10-day IR list, by the way, before his defense against the, um, before his defense in the title picture. Chase Claypool's on the shelf with an injury in Hammy as well. So, um, really uh, not looking good there, everybody. That's all That's all there's a matter for that, everybody. All right, so uh, first things, I'm going to start things up with how the uh, WWE Draft Night 1 went down last night. So, here it is, uh, ladies and gentlemen. You got, you got, um, let's see. What do we got here? What do we got, what do we got here? You got... Oh, here we go. I'm sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. You got... Let's see. The WWE Draft. So, Roman Reigns got, is staying on SmackDown. He's the tribal chief that had the table. Big E, the WWE Chair, will be staying on Raw. Raw Women's Sham Charlotte Flair is going to SmackDown. Bianca Bella is going to Raw. Drew McIntyre is, co- is going to SmackDown. He's coming for the Universe title, by the way. RK Bro, the Raw Tag Team Champs, are going to be staying on Raw. Kobe Kingston, Xavier Woods, and the New Day, or even the New Day, they're going back to SmackDown. So clearly, yeah, sure, there's, there's a little bit of a New Day reunion there on Raw. We all saw New Day back together. You remember last last time's draw, WWE Draft when Biggie was staying on Raw, and then or excuse me, Biggie was staying on SmackDown, and then you know, Kobe Kingston, Xavier Woods would be going to Raw. Well. Tales of Turn yet again, the New Day breaking up. So, yeah, the New Day have broke up yet again where you got Big E, the WWE champ, st- staying on Raw, and you got Xavier Woods and Kobe Kingston. They are going back to SmackDown. And clearly the New Day, they broke it. This is the second time break we've ever seen. It's just sad to see that, though. So are they, are they ever going to reunite? Let me know in the comment section about that, how you feel about it, what your reactions are, your responses. That's all there's going to say on that. Also, guys, um, Edge is going to be going to Raw, by the way, even though Southern Rounds have made his house, and Edge is going to get his revenge. Happy Corbin and Madcap Moss, they're going to be staying on SmackDown. The women's tag team chance of Rhea Ripley and Nikki ASH are going to be staying on Raw. Hit Row goes to SmackDown. Yes. SmackDown's hit row, everybody. You get Top Dollar and uh, Mashanti there from B More Baltimore, by the way. That's the big moment right there. But see, SmackDown's hit row. Wow, that's huge. So hit row of Isaiah Storm's got to celebrate her birthday this past week. B Fab, who um had a no DQ match against um Electra Lopez. You got um Top Dollar, you got Shanti, by the way. They had some few with um La Familia, by the way. Legato, Legato del Fantasma as well. So, um, yeah. So, Hit Row is going to SmackDown, everybody. And it, it, it's now SmackDown's Hit Row. The Hit Row SmackDown. That's all there is. I got to say that. Also, Keith Brick had Lee stays on Raw. Naomi stays on SmackDown. Ray Don Mysterio are going to be going heading to Raw. Jeff Hardy goes back to SmackDown. Austin Theory goes to Raw. Nia Jax is on the show with the elbow injuries. Crazy Nia Jax. She's going to be staying on Raw. You got um, 24 7 champ Reggie is go- staying on Raw. R-True stays on Raw. Drake Maverick stays on Raw. 
T-Bar stays on Raw. Akira Taz- Tazawa stays on Raw. Otis and Chad Gable, they're going to Raw. Apollo Crews and Commander Aziz, they're going to Raw. Dewdrop stays on Raw. Zelina Vega is going to Raw. Drew Gulak goes to SmackDown. You also got, sorry again, guys. Mace, he's going to SmackDown. Mansoor is going to SmackDown. Mustafa Ali goes to SmackDown. Tony Storm, who didn't get engaged, she's staying on SmackDown. And Aaliyah, she goes to SmackDown as well. This is a big, so this is a big moment right there. Those legends are, that is night one of the w, of the 2021 WWE Draft, and that's all the news you need to know, everybody, on that note. So, another more you need to know on that, everybody. So, don't forget to catch night two of the WWE Draft this coming Monday night on Raw, and that's all the you need to know. And also, guys, um, the King of the Ring tournament is coming back, by the way, starting next next Friday. And also, there will be a Queen's Crown Tournament, everybody. I'm not sure it's going to be Queen of the Ring, but now it's called Queen's Crown Tournament. I mean, that that that's something that it's been rumbling for weeks. Now that it's already, the cat's out the bag now. So, yeah, yes, there will be a Queen's Crown Tournament. The competitors have not been announced yet. They can announce them by, hopefully, this Monday night. And um, that's all there's to on that. So they'll be competing about Raw and SmackDown. And the finals, by the way, they're, they'll be at Crown Jewel, by the way. It's all there's for that. And speaking of Crown Jewel, by the way, Becky Lynch is going to defend her SmackDown women's title against Bianca Belair and Sasha Banks. We all saw what happened when Sasha Banks date made her comeback and to, took out both uh, Bianca Belair and Becky Lynch, by the way. So there will be a triple threat match. I knew at, there will be a triple threat match at Crown Jewel. For Samantha Woman's title, that's all there's need to know with that, everybody. So, best is yet there. Also, another thing I want to get into, by the way, that um, the Ground Canary will not be at the Pratt's re- return reunion, by the way, because of a fractured ribs he's had. So, he will not be attending the Pratt's reunion, by the way. Although, Tama Bay is going to be a rude awakening, which he will be. And, well, that's it for him. So, everyone's going to know that for sure. He's, 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 but Ground Canary's on the shelf for weeks. So, not looking good there. You hate to see it. You hate to see it, guys. Also, Le'Veon Bell is going to make his Ravens debut against the Broncos, by the way, tomorrow, by the way. Also, another news that Clayton Kershaw has a forearm injury. He um, he's placed on the 10-day injury reserve list before defense, Dodgers defense in the World Series title picture. Also, saying that. Also, another news that Chase, Chase Claypool's in the shelf with an injured hammy, by the way. Not look good there. So, uh, that's all you know. And also this. John Bone Jones... Locks and loads on his fiance Jesse Moses. Stem assault and after it stems from his domestic abuse and tampering with a cop car arrest. And he's gonna be doing court this month on the twenty sixth. Honestly, what happened here? I mean sure sure John Bones Jones, you know, he was arrested on his domestic abuse arrest and he was tampering with with the cop car, banging his head in the cop car. And um, clearly there's something to be said about that, so a little uncalled for, by the way. It's just not right. So that's all there is. Everything to know on that, buddy. So that's all I can say on that. All guys on the Venom. Let the Be Carnage movie is out now, guys. Check that out. And that was all I get to, by the way. Iron Mike Tyson would literally destroy Logan Paul or that piece of trash, Jake Paul. I think it's like a hundred mil payday, that is, by the way. So that's the interesting news right there. I hope that Iron Mike Tyson does destroy that. He's got his eyes on Lennox Lewis, by the way, as well. So that's that's some interesting news right there. That's all they need to know on that, everybody. So that's the best you get there, and that's all there's need to know. Also, got some other news, by the way, that um, Little Fizz apologized to Omarion for updating his um, Omarion's baby, baby mama of his, April Jones, by the way, a couple years back, while on the Millennium Tour. So um, clearly, that that's... Omarion didn't quite know. And... Um, he did. Amarin did. He did forgive Lil Fizz for that, and they had to stick to the uh, Millennium Tour on that. So that's all there is. You need to know that. So that's something you don't do. You don't. You don't go dating people, people's interests or baby mamas, and they got kiddos too. So that's all there's you need to know there, buddy. Also, um, other news I want to also get into. By the way, that um, let's see we got here. Let's see. Greek Freak goes undercover. At CVS, he says, no, recognize me. Clearly, they all know you're there. They all know you're there. We all know it. So, your thoughts, everybody? And uh, that's all I was going to say on that. And, uh, yep. 
So you need to know. So see, so Greg Free got the call, but he was at a series. He is the um, defending champ, by the way. That's all there's need to know on that. And that's all I could say. I didn't mean to know on that, everybody. Also, guys, some other news, by the way, that um, I want to wish happy birthdays out to Kelly Reaper, Lorraine Bracco, Elizabeth McLaughlin, Sky Blue, Huda, Catton, Rennie Rucci, Rucci, Rucci Uchi Gucci, Camilla Bell, Savina, Cam, Savino, Hina, Hina Khan, Chai Meadows, Samantha Burks, Phil Kessel, Brianna Brown, Alex, Tons, Tons, Tyson Chandler, Joe Ingles. You got um, Vogue Williams, Casey, Bachelor, Norris Diaz, Norris Diaz Perez, Cher Lloyd. Ricky Steinhouse Jr. So, send me all your birthday wishes. Shout out Sweet Timber. Please, please be sure you do so on that. And that's everything you need to know. And that's all I got to say in there, everybody. So, that's it. Now, don't forget, guys, tomorrow night, Tom Brady's in for Red Wing. Now, there's a bit of a homecoming video for Tom Brady. You got to check that out. Your thoughts about that. So, yes, Tom Brady's, he's, he's his homecoming. It's tomorrow night. And he will be in for Red Wing. I, I can tell you this, guys. So, Tom Brady. He's going to be one of the most hated goats in history, which is, I mean, they call it Goatsburg, Massachusetts, really? Go, excuse me, I'm sorry, not Goatsburg, Goatsboro, really? So, um, Clay Tom, I mean, and, and, and get this, Tom Brady, I mean, he's got like, New England's got 3,268 kiddos named Brady. Clearly, the Tom Brady era, era is going to die. And when it does, Tom Brady's going to hang it up for good. I can tell you that, everybody. And when he does, <laughs> you guys sure you won't see the light of day. Because come tomorrow night, it'll be a night to remember. And it, it may be one of the biggest games in Tom Brady's luscious career. And people are going to call this, you know, a, a pre-Super Bowl matchup that a lot of people will, will want to see. And it's going to feel like one. And even though it's one of them talks about stories, though, but Tom Brady, he just hopes he wants to stick it to Belichick or Belichick wants to stick it to to Tom Brady. Let's be honest here for a minute. Tom Brady has been in nine Super Bowls with the Patriots, which he has. He's already won six of them. He already got a seventh one last season, proving that he can get a title on his own without Belichick, which he already did. Belichick, he got eliminated from the playoffs. Belichick in the past, they got eliminated from the playoffs. I'm sorry, I'm sorry they, got lim- they got eliminated. They, got, they didn't make it to the playoffs, which they did not. So it tells you that, you know, they're done. So Tom Brady, I'll tell you this. You're going to be in for a rude awakening. Come hell on why, Tom Brady. You know for a fact that that's on you. What happens to you tomorrow, that's on you, Tom Brady. And Tom Brady, you were the face of the franchise from day one. You have for 20 consecutive years. You were the lifeblood of that franchise, which you were. You care. You carried that team on your shoulders. You held them to title reigns. You've done that. But I ain't carrying the bucks on your shoulders now. So everyone knows, everyone's going to know what's going to happen here. Because you're going to feel exposed the next day yet again. And Tom Brady, guess what? You're not going to make it out alive with that one. No, 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 no. You may think you will, but you won't. So Tom Brady, if you're so eager to get this match, you may, you may, you better pray. You better get the advice you're going to get. Because if you don't, it's all over. Sure, fans can cheer and boo you all you want. That's fine. And sure, you may be a sellout goat, which you are. And you may be a trader school, a line goat, which you are, by the way. But at the end of the day, you need to understand this, Tom Brady. The Tom Brady, whenever that time comes, you're going to hang it up for good. And I pray that you do. And if you don't, well, jokes to you, Tom Brady. Sure, you want to play until you're 45, so you want to play until you're 50. Ridiculous, Tom Brady. Come on. You can play at 45 if you want. Or play until you're 50. Because Tom Brady, you need to realize this, that you, you, you are in control of your own destiny. You, you can dictate where, when, where, why you want to end your career as a buck. Your thoughts about that. And you may have something to store for, for everybody out there, something you should have done months ago. So that's all I got to say about that, everybody. I'm going to get this now. Kyrie Irving, you know, he said that he hasn't been vaxxed yet. 
Let me tell this is Kyrie Irving's face, all right? I know he's listening. Kyrie Irving, get the COVID shot, all right? Just get the shot, all right? Don't be some chicken dish, all right? So if you don't get the shot, you might get traded or you might get released. We don't know for sure. Or, or, you may, or better yet, you may as well just retire anyway in case your career go by. That's what you can do right there. So honestly, honestly, Kyrie Irving, you know, you got to you gotta do the right thing. Just do it for the fans. Do it for the culture. Do it for yourself. Do it for your close ones. Do it for the country. Do it for the stable mates. Do, do it for everybody out there. The fans at home. The fans around the world. Fans in the across the country. The global, on social, digital. Everybody out there. To get the cover shot, Kyrie Irving, just do it. All right? Just get the cover shot. That's all you got to do, Kyrie Irving. That's all you got to do. So that's all I can say in there, buddy. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to do it right there for the Clue Level Sports Board. Live subscribe to the Clue Level Sports Board YouTube channel on Facebook by any means necessary. Your thoughts and responses on night one of the of the 2020 WWE Draft last night. Thoughts about that. Be sure to catch night two of the WWE Draft this coming Monday night on Raw. That's just Monday night. That's all I got to say on that. What are your thoughts on the King of the Ring tournament returning this coming uh, next week? And also, um, what are your thoughts on the Queen's Crown Tournament, by the way, coming up next week? Everybody thoughts about that and who the competitors are, and they haven't been announced yet. When they are, I'll address that for sure. Hopefully, I will do so. That's all he's doing that. He listen to the Gronkinator not returning to the um, his old rules because of fractured ribs he has. Let me thoughts about that. Let me know comments about that. I'll just about sure, buddy. Your thoughts on Jumbo Jones smooth lock and loaded on his um his fiance Jesse Moses did despite the fact after he after Jumbo was arrested over his domestic abuse. And um, tampering with the vehicle where he had been a cop car. Thoughts about that, everybody. Also this. A giant gator chomped on a small gator that's six feet. And this is in Horry County, South Carolina. Wow. That's a big one right there. We thought about that, everybody. Let me know in the comments. I'll address my shirt, everybody. It's all this you doing on that. With us a little fizz, apologizing to Amarion, to, um... To, who was who and Lil Fizz is one of uh, Amarion's B2, B2K band members, by the way. Your thoughts about that, everybody? I'll just want to share, everybody. Just for the fact that he, um, dating, dating April Jones, who's Amarion's baby mom, by the way, a couple of years ago. And your thoughts about that while I'm learning to her? Your thoughts about that, everybody? You think that Lil Fizz should be, um, shitting himself? Thoughts about that? Let me know in the comments, and I'll just want to share, buddy. Your thoughts on, um, Chase Claybull being on the show with an injured hammy, by the way. That's about that. I'll just want to show everybody. Wait, that's Le'Veon Bell making his uh, Ravens debut against the Broncos. I thought about that. I'll just want to show everybody. Does a Clayton Kershaw having an injured forearm, placing him on the 10 day IL list, by the way. IR list, by the way. And this is before his defense, for the Dodgers defense, and title picture in the World Series title picture. Thoughts about that, but I'll just want to show everybody. That's everything you know on that. That's all I can say for that, for sure, everybody. All you need to know. Same by the way, the Sky Blue, Kelly Ripa, Lorraine Bracco, Elizabeth McLaughlin, McLaughlin, Sky Blue, Hoda Katan, Rennie, Ruchi, Uchi, Gucci, Camilla, Bell, Samino, Kina Khan, Chloe Meadows, Samantha Burks, Barks, Phil Kessel, Brianna Brown, Alex Lonson. Tyson Chandler, Joe Ingles, Vogue, Williams, Casey, Bachelor, Norris, Diaz, Perez, and Chloe Lloyd, Ricky Steinhouse Jr. So somebody birthday wishes, shout out, sweet to them, please be sure to do something that. Does everything to know on that? That's all I got to say for sure, buddy. Also, Venom, Let the Be Carnage movie is out now, guys. Check that out. That's all that you know on that, everybody. That's all that I can say. We well, listen to Iron Mike Tyson saying that he's he would destroy... Logan Paul, nor that piece of trash, Jake Paul, by the way, and Hundred Mil Payday. Who do you think? Who do you think the Iron Mike Jones, Iron Mike Tyson's gonna get to next? Thoughts about that, but I'll just want to share, buddy. Also, this that Clarissa T Rex Shields said she would literally destroy that piece of trash, Jake Paul. Let me know the comments about that. You think that match would ever happen? Let me know the comments about that. I'll just want to share, buddy, and that's all I can say on that. I've been for breaking news. Sometimes level level day some money so on. It's a whole lot more in the clue of sports. Whatever everything sports later. And as you can know, all I got to say, but take care, you guys. You guys have a good, good evening. Please be safe with that. Bye bye.